Hi guys and welcome to my second video about Neural Networks. In my first video I was demonstrating this Sunflower robot and uh, I recently made an Excel file for this where you can simulate and see the behavior of this Neural Network. Uh, in this project uh, I've made a Neural Network with just a single hidden layer but uh, you can easily modify this project and make a deep neural network just by adding more and more hidden layers. So this way your neural network with a single layer will become a deep neural network. And I also wanted to save and load the weights and the topology from the files, so you don't have to uh, train the neural network over and over again after you restart your MCU or your program. So for this I made this uh, Visual Studio project and I added many functions in C because I want to use this, I want to implement this into the MCU uh, which drivers are made in C so for this reason I needed to write some parts of code in C not in C++ entirely now I'm going to demonstrate my code here you can see my training data. I have four inputs and two outputs. And first output is simulation of uh, end logic of first and second input. And uh, for this uh, second output, I simulate uh, exclusive OR logic uh, of the whole four inputs. So only the first case is true and the last case. I also already have trained neural network, so here you can see all the weights. So now my neural network uh, doesn't have to train, it, it skips the training and just loads the data. So now you can see uh, it's just the RAM mode where these numbers match matches with this training data and now I'm going to close this and I can delete the weights and save it so there are no more weights and now the neural network is going to train because the number of weights didn't match uh, with the topology it is going to take about 20 or 30 seconds And now the neural network is trained and my text editor is going to ask to reload the data. Yes. So the weights are saved again and the simulation works well. Since I wanted to use this code on my MCUs, uh, which drivers are made in C, I needed to find a way how can I access the vectors uh, and access them somehow in C language. So I came up with these functions, which uh, just basically 
push zeros uh, to the vector and then I can easily access these uh, vectors the same way as I would uh, access arrays in C language. So this way I can save and load the weights, save the data, you know, learning outputs, everything I needed. So this way I was able to combine C and C++. I would like to mention that I added this Excel file into my old neural network project for STM32 and I also uploaded uh, this Visual Studio project into GitHub too. So both links will be available in the description. So thank you for watching.